fellow captains, time for another game commentary, and boy, this was an interesting game. Uh, this was a game I played with Fragmentation and Zoem on the NA server, and I'm playing the Östergötland, and uh, I have support with Fragmentation in his uh, Z46, and uh, Zoem in Frederik de Grose. Uh, right from the start, we decide to uh, go to the nearest cap because uh, there's no uh, radars and no C. Uh, oh, yes, one CV, but no radars in the enemy team. So uh, we might actually try to get an early cap as soon as possible here. So um, uh, indicates that he wants to go outside and. Uh, get some crossfires from there and okay and uh, there we go and I decide to be a little bit cautious because uh, I do not want to run into the Fletcher or the uh, German destroyer Schultz that might be here as well so uh, let's see and uh, yeah, uh, the main uh, focus is, of course, uh, there's two submarines in the game. And, oh boy, it's a pain to play against them. But, if there's no sub uh, in this cap now, we should be able to get the cap. Frag decides to uh, attack the cap pretty, I must say, hard, and um, I take a look to see if I can land some torps on the incoming BBs there. It's max distance, but uh, maybe, maybe, if, if I'm lucky, one or two, two torps maybe. And at least that will prevent anyone pushing into the cap from that uh, gap in the island there. So, let's see, what do we have? What battleships are coming in there? It's... Uh, yeah, Nelson and Pommern. And... Uh, they might be in for a surprise. Pommern does have Hydro, so he should not get Torf, but... Who knows? He might have forgotten to... Yeah... He uh, doesn't run Hydro, he got caught off guard. He will take a couple of Torps. Perfect. And Floods. Oh, four Torps. Nice hit there. And... Um... Now it's time to uh, defend. We got the cap. Uh, enemy cap B. And there's quite a lot of the enemies here, so I do not want to go away from here and let the, this cap go, even though I would, would like to get B cap. So, um, let's defend. Frag gets caught off guard, going out, out of the smoke, and uh, crossfired, and he's in big, big, big trouble. He played a little bit too offensive, pushed in a little bit too much, and now he has troubles to get the hell out of there. Nice work. My second set of torps... I land one torp on the Nelson, but uh, that's not enough. Yeah, and Frag goes down, sadly. Here comes the planes from the CV, but should not be a problem, because Erland and Halland has really good AA. The bigger problem is the spotting they provide, and uh, Nelson clapped me pretty hard. But it could be worse. We still have control of this cap. We should be able to defend. Oh, and there goes... Nelson and uh, let's see oh and they retaliate immediately 
Uh, we have two DDs down. This is not good. Okay, let's see. What do we have? Johan de Witt is here. Um, could be a little bit of a problem. I try to see if I can go and torp him if he leaves in this direction. Most likely not. At least we got the B cap, but we lost another ship, so it's not looking good. Here comes the planes, here comes the German DD Schulz. A DD I really didn't like to see him, but okay. Pommern is pushing up. Hopefully, Zoem can take okay, care of him. A torp into the smoke, because you all know smokes are torp magnets. Of course, I have the uh, torp there. They got C. I go in to contest it. I really would like to take it back. Johan de Witt goes down. Perfect. And shores go down. Perfect. Nice work, CV. Gun I get detected again, but it's plain. I shoot them up the sky. Really well. Ah, okay, this uh, DD left the cap, but let's torp some. See if I can hit him in the rear when he's running away. You never know. We lose another ship. Every time we get one of their, they get one of us. And the Zoom has some troubles with the Pommern pushing up. I need to help him, so I turn around. See if I can get some torps into him. Palmer in there. Yeah, and so is dead. Unfortunately, not mu not much he can do there. And Palmer is this time running the hydro, of course. <laughs> you don't make the same mistake twice. But I'm perfectly close, so uh, still getting one hit and uh, flood. Since I'm already detected, I can shoot. I have some support and the uh, Pommern goes down, but so do, does our Seattle. So what can I say? One ship uh, <laughs> from both sides every time. Okay, Schultz is still there. I need to take care of him. So I need to head back to the cap. Torpedoes, There's ahead. more ship turning it up here, so... Oh, Torps? From who? That was not Schultz, Torps. That must have been the Akatsuki Torps, maybe. I didn't catch how many they were, but could be. Most likely because he was spotted lost uh, to the left of those island there, so mm, might be. Nelson decides to turn in there, which means I could get one or two torps into his bow. Hopefully get some flood, get some damage done on him. Because I do not want to fight two DDs and a battleship, especially not Nelson firing HG. Enemy Akatsuki gets spotted. Uh, Probably heading for our CV. Oh, I hit one torp on Nelson and flooding. Perfect. 
so now I'm a, a bit... Um, I don't know what to do. Should I defend our CV and leave the cap or defend the cap? I decide, uh, no, we need the cap. Hopefully the CV and the uh, rest of the team can take care of that DD. All stations requesting fire on the designated target. Torpedoes, dead ahead. Well, let's take some parting shots, Torpedoes see if we can get some damage at least. Yeah, ship away a little bit. And torps from that side. Okay, this means Schultz has moved away on the other side. A little bit of torp beat there. I'm not detected, so I move in. I really would like to get rid of the Schultz there. But that's dangerous, as so long as Nelson is there. Please, please, team, can you take care of him for me? Then I might be able to take care of the Schultz. <clears throat> no, not shooting, so I don't want to get detected. Here comes Schultz Torps again. He ro reloads very fast. Well, we got rid of Nelson, which means I can take care of Schultz. And he leaves the smoke, which means my Torps will not hit him, but they will force him to move. And it seems that I have a little bit better DPM than Schultz. And he's not hitting me as hard as he could. That's good for me. Maybe I stand a chance. A full health Schultz against me. I set him on fire. Knocks his engine again. The ship is on fire! And can I gun him down? He sets me on fire. I don't want to damage gun him yet, because if he sets me on fire again, I'm toast. Engine boost deactivated. There we go, there we go. And finally, yes, I managed to get rid of him. And at this time, he pushed me so far away that I accidentally ran into the CV. Thank you very much. Uh, not what I wanted. I wanted to turn back, but hey, the CB. Nice uh, torp food. Torpedoes astern. Torpedoes to port. And now we are in a really big trouble because enemy has two caps. We have one. They have four ships. We have three. And someone is capping C, of course. Most likely Akatsuki, I get six torps on that CV. Okay, let's switch to AP. See if AP does anything. Oh yeah, Citadel. Thank you very much. And CV gone. Perfect. Well, need to turn back, need to defend C, and uh, hopefully our two remaining subs can take care of the enemy subs. We still have a chance to win this. One of our, our subs are full health and one is two third health, so we stand a really good chance to win this. I need to head back as fast as I can to the cap. Engine boost is on cooldown. There we go. Engine Boosting boost away. Activated. 
because now points goes quickly, quickly, quickly to the enemy team. With three caps and we have none. So there's no time to lose. And of course our full health sub can't take care of the enemy sub so he get torped. Which means his fight is getting even harder. The enemy Akatsuki is half health. I should be able to get him if I can get into the cap in time and spot him. I might be able to get gun him down but he goes undetected. Well, our other sub is uh, capping B. That's good. At least blocking some incoming points for the enemy team. And I go in to cap uh, C cap again. For the third time in this game. Oof. Well. Can I spot the enemy Atsuki? There he is. Where do he go? Alright, uh, I, th I think he's going... I think he might go for our sub there, so I put some torps in that general direction. Need to get the cap before I move on. Engine boost deactivated. Finally, get the ca getting the cap. Okay. Time to move on for B. And we need B cap. We need to keep actually with this uh, <laughs> amount of time left. We actually must, ca uh, we can't win by capping. We need to kill all. There's no time left. And of course, the sub gets sunk. Well, shit. Pretty much seals the deal. No chance we can win this, I think. All the enemy had to do now is run and hide. But there's one. So oh, and there's Akatsuki. Can I get in? No, I don't think I can kill him. There's high caliber at least. But yeah, he's going for the sub. He's uh, going for the depth charges. Please, please, please survive. I dodge those torps. Guns was in the wrong direction. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No. Ah. Oh, yes. One shell went over the island and hit him. Okay. No need to cap here. Uh, oh. Actually, getting torps on me and depth charges on the sub. But he got some torps on me, that's not good. It's kill all now, kill all. And the only chance for me right now is to move closer to him, because if I am close enough he can't launch torps at me. I need to move there as fast as possible, I need to tor uh, de depth charge him. I need to get rid of him. It's only 40 seconds left of the game. If I can kill him, I might have the chance to get the last enemy sub as well. But here I didn't pay attention. I should have seen that the ping came from the right side. 
And I turn to the right side. Not good. Five, six, seven, eight. Yes, I get get him, but the remaining sub is on my broadside, and I cannot dodge that. Which means end of game. Thank you and good night. Uh, this was a good game. One hundred fifty-eight thousand nine hundred damage. Uh, one soul kept with two assisted, four kills, two thousand base XP. My absolute highest damage game in uh, Östergötland. And that's it. And thank you and goodbye. See you again next time.